Funny Cave. Seven crazy ways people have quit their jobs. Number seven, Taco Bell manager. Adam, the Taco Bell shift manager, submitted his resignation on this sign right here. He was upset that he was denied time off after he had worked 22 days in a row. That's right, he worked at Taco Bell for 22 days in a row. And I just have to say, it's not often you hear the words Taco Bell and 22 days in a row without hearing the word diarrhea in there somewhere. Number six, personal driver. A personal driver was not paid the salary that he had expected to get, so he quit by parking his owner's car in a very special way, as you can see in this photo. Number five, newscast director. Mark Herman, the newscast director at the Arizona station KOLD, announced he was leaving by bringing in a cake with the text of his resignation letter on the top. Well, at least that will save his co-workers from having to buy a going away cake. Number four, restaurant workers. A Chipotle restaurant in State College, Pennsylvania closed down unexpectedly because the workers quit. And this sign was taped to the door of the restaurant. Hey honey, it looks like the Chipotle is closed down. Let's go to Taco Bell instead. Oh damn. What is it with these Mexican restaurants and unhappy employees? Number three, video game designer. Jared Farbs decided to leave his job as a developer at 2K Australia in order to do independent game development full time. For his resignation, he created a short playable flash game featuring Mario delivering the news along with this message. Thank you 2K Australia, you gave me a paycheck, an incredible project and a world class team to learn from. But my princess is in another castle. Number 2. Flight Attendant After working at JetBlue for 20 years, flight attendant Steve Slater grabbed the intercom and cursed and yelled at the passengers on the plane. He then grabbed a beer and went down the emergency chute to the tarmac. Later that day, Slater was arrested and charged with criminal mischief and reckless endangerment to which he pleaded not guilty. And if you ask me, the only thing Slater is guilty of is looking like a gay Bill Burr. Number 1. News Anchor Russia Today news anchor Liz Wall resigned on live TV. She announced, I cannot be part of a network funded by the Russian government that whitewashes the actions of Putin. And that's it. Thanks for watching. And in the comments, let me know of the worst job you've ever had. Bye for now.